Well, hello, Bishop Patrick. L wouldn't seen you here. Coming to you today, to my friends out there, to invite you to meet me tonight for Bible study. Yes, Bible study. We're going to study the word of the Lord because I have something to tell you that's going on. Listen, the God of the Bible is using everything that is happening in your life, even as I speak, especially if you're a born again child of God and trusting him, he's using everything in your life, even things that right now may, may cause a little instability. Well, we serve a God who's using these things to bring us to a place, to bring you to a place, to bring me to a place of stability. The truth is, my friends, that the God of the Bible is in full and absolute control of our lives. All we have to do is serve him, submit ourselves to him, and just trust him. You know, in this world that we're living in today, there's so much upheaval going on on, on just about every level. If you, whether you're looking at television, someone sent me a, a picture the other day of a, a caption uh, that was uh, uh, said to have been from the basketball player or the ex-basketball player. I don't know whether he's playing or not. I don't keep up with him. Uh, Dwayne Wade and showed his wife, his daughter, and his sons. And in the back, the sign said, my girls. Now, th that little boy is a boy. And uh, uh, I, I, to me, if uh, it, it, if it was a doctored photograph, I apologize. If it was something, a hoax, I apologize. But if real, is that not child abuse? Is that not uh, uh, an attempt to bring confusion? Uh, don't you think the little boy deserves better? All oh, that things that's going on in our world. People have sent me uh, pictures of uh, uh, of uh, the artist uh, Pharrell, and he's uh, trying to redefine masculinity. Now, I'm going to be honest with you. Some of these people think more highly of themselves than they ought to think. Now, uh, I, I think he's the, the uh, Gary, I think he's the happy song guy. Happy, happy, happy. Well, listen, all of you that got happy and, <laughs> and you went uh, happy, crazy, I mean, some of you are all on Facebook and some preacher's wife dancing and, oh, she, <laughs> she was getting down. Well, I wonder how, 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 do, how do you feel now? Um, not long ago, this same man had a gospel explosion, a gospel explosion. And all it was designed to do is, is just set us up, pull us in. You know, we've never met, met a mic that we don't like, a camera that we would shy away from, or a supposed Platforms this is one of the things in the body of Christ. We, we assume that every platform that we get, uh, we get to stand on is of God. And, you know, the Lord is opening doors for me to stand on this platform and that platform. Well, I'm here to tell you every platform is not of God. And we've got to at least be as wise as our unsaved counterparts because these people have strategies. Long-term and short-term goals. Short-term goal is to pull us in and to gain the trust of the, uh, of the church, gain the trust of the believers, and then uh, try to subvert the work of God. Man, now I'm getting a little bit into the message that God has given me to preach to uh, North Carolina Third during our call meeting this Saturday. So I'm going to I'm going to wrap this up. There's so many things, so many things that God is speaking and that the Lord is saying. But tonight I want to talk to you. I want to show show you in the Word of the Lord, where no matter where you are or no matter what's going on, don't panic. Praise the Lord. Don't have a panic attack. Don't fall apart. Don't come unglued. Don't even be dismayed. God's working it out. You know, the Bible says that now we know that all things work together for the good of them that love the Lord. Amen. That is so true. I want to show you where the Lord is working on your behalf. Just trust him and stay with the Bible. Christians, let's keep it simple. Let's keep it simple. Christians, let's remain Christian. And if the Christians continue to be Christian, 
then everything is going to be all right. I'll see you tonight, Christians, as we walk in biblical Christianity. God bless.